It's time for the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan. Blake Sloan, one of the top real estate agents not only on the Grand Strand, but in the world. He's been featured in Forbes Magazine, The Wall Street Journal, NBC, and many other publications. And now, the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan. I am your host, Dave Priest, and for the next 30 minutes, going to be trying to give you as much good information about the real estate industry, what's happening locally along the Grand Strand. Blake Sloan will be here to tell you all about it. Over the next 30 minutes, you're going to be hearing some great information. I know you're going to be having questions that you want to have answered. So if you do, go ahead and get a pen. I'll give you some places where you can get in touch with Blake. First of all, his phone number, you should know by now, by hearing it on the radio station, it's 808-SOLD. That's 808-SOLD. You can also go onto the website, blakesloanradio.com. And if you want to ask him any questions, here's the email address. And I'll give this to you many times throughout the course of the next 30 minutes. Ask at blakesloanradio.com. That's real simple. Ask at blakesloanradio.com. So, uh, again, get those pens and pencils ready, and you can uh, get all your questions, and I'll give you those uh, addresses again here in just a little bit. But in the meantime, without further ado, we uh, welcome Blake Sloan on the air. And Blake, appreciate you being here this morning. No problem. Thank you. Glad to be here. Got a uh, busy next 30 minutes here on the uh, the radio. And uh, what do you want to get out? What do you want to tell people over the next 30 minutes? Uh, we got a lot to cover today, a lot of great information. Uh, but first, we're going to show you know how to find the best deals when buying a new home and um, how you can literally beat other buyers to the newest listings uh, before they hit the market. Literally how most uh, you can find out before most realtors even know about them. I'm also going to cover the seven power principles that can help you get your soul, home sold faster and for up to 21% more money. And uh, we also got a special guest. Um, he's actually one of the top loss mitigators and uh, short sale specialists uh, in the whole country. And that's uh, Randy Privet. He works with us. He's actually a certified uh, short sale expert and also a certified distressed property expert. And uh, we'll be able to go in detail of anyone that may be facing, uh, you know, challenges with their mortgage or maybe behind or possibly uh, go behind. going to show exactly what you can do and uh, what options everyone has in that situation. Well, I'm kind of looking forward to this because there's a lot of subjects that I don't know a lot about. Real estate is one of them. So I think I might be taking notes myself through the course of the next 30 minutes and beyond. Uh, but uh, be honest with you, first of all, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Now, we've heard various things. We've heard the commercials on the radio station. Uh, you've been dubbed the real estate whiz kid, featured in Forbes, Wall Street Journal, NBC, Glenn Beck, Sean Hannity have endorsed you. Uh, I mean, it's a lot of accomplishments, uh, and it's you know pretty mind-blowing. How did all this happen? How did you get into real estate, and why are you so darn good at it? <laughs> well, first of all, just really thankful and blessed to have such a great team of experts that also work with us. Uh, we have a great group of, of young and uh, people who are really, really focused on real estate, very passionate about real estate. Uh, but me personally, uh, grew up in the business, whole mom, dad, aunt, uncle, grandpa, grandma, literally entire family sold real estate. Um, so I kind of always had an idea of what I wanted to do and uh, knew that I could probably be good at it. Um, but got into it uh, in 2004 and um, kind of always knew there would probably be a, a different way. I was really always fascinated with business and things and um, always read a lot of business books, but always knew, hey, look, I need to find the best and kind of emulate and do what they're doing. So immediately, once I got in, I just went and found the best, uh, searched the entire country and went to them and just reached out and said, hey, look, I want to know what you know. How can I, I learn what you're doing? And um, literally hired coaches and, and built I guess, relationships with other top agents across the country. And uh, for years, we've been masterminding and sharing ideas and learning, um, but continually watching what's happening in our industry and also in other industries and see how we can actually implement that and use that in our business to even, you know, I guess, take that forward and really take the reins in taking real estate in a new direction as so many new companies and agents are using different technologies. And if you see most of those are stuff that's used in other industries uh, months and years before we were getting it, and um, that's really just been putting all those pieces together, really focused on over living to our clients in every aspect. Everyone that works with us is very passionate, and uh, we all love and enjoy what we do, and uh, we all get up and have fun every day doing it. Well, the real estate industry, I don't think it's any secret to anybody, hasn't been kind to a lot of people over the last uh, several years, but you seem to have been doing okay. I guess the big question is, is that how, how are you able to sell homes so fast, and you're guaranteeing them? when everybody else is having so many problems. Right, and there's a, a ton of aspects to that, but what we did is we developed a repeatable system that's even trademarked. Uh, we developed something called the Guaranteed Sold System, and it's a proven repeatable system that proactively manages 100 different variables uh, throughout the entire process of getting your home sold, and it virtually guarantees your home to get sold faster and for up to 21% more money than traditional real estate methods. 
And what it is, most people don't realize there's so many different variables um, through the entire process. Um, and there's one shocking fact that a lot of people don't realize until it's actually their home on the market. But um, not just here locally, but also on a national uh, level, over 50% of homes fail to sell the first time they're put on the marketplace. So literally, you have a 50% plus chance of failure when you're just listing your house just you know, with anyone or, or just calling the first person you see. And um, you know, I always felt, I'm sure not get an airplane if there's a 50% chance of me making it, right? So <laughs> people a lot of times will just go out there with their largest asset and just kind of chance it. But what we did is we literally reverse engineered every possible aspect and point that we could get leverage through the entire home sale process. And we create a leverage at each and every one of those points. Um, but some of the biggest mistakes that we see others, there's, you know, maybe a price strategy, uh, the marketing exposure, negotiation, even all, how your, your home's positioned in the marketplace makes a massive difference. And what our system does, it takes every single one of those into account and it proactively manages those all the way through the process to sell it faster and for more money. Mm -hmm. and, and I can kind of go in detail uh, when we talk about the, the seven power principles of, of our system. But one big thing there is called that principle of price elasticity. And um, what it means is, you know, the market goes up and down, right, as, as usual. Oh, yeah, sure. But in each neighborhood, there's always the low end and the high end, right? So there's no exact fixed selling price for any home. Um, but what happens is however those variables are handled either makes that go up or it makes it go down. And what our system does, we want to get you the high end of that price range. And uh, we'll kind of cover that. But um, I guess the, the, the simple way to do it is we're able to – uh, increased demand for each property with that. A perfect example of that would be a classic car or something. It, right. What What's your favorite classic car? Would you say? I uh, I'm always been uh, partial to Mustangs, like okay. in, you know, sixties. Sixties. So let's say, what year would you like? I don't know, sixty sixty five. Okay, let's say you got a nineteen sixty five Mustang class. It's mint, perfect condition, um, probably worth a lot of money, right? Um, you can take that car, put it in your driveway, or probably put it next to seventeen out here, and you can probably get it sold. Right sure. for, yeah. for for a good amount of money. Well, let's say you take that same exact car, you put it in your driveway on there, but you also put that car in every single classic car trader magazine, right? Every single car uh, enthusiast magazine, and even deeper than that, every single classic Mustang enthusiast magazine and website. You're probably going to get a lot more money for that car, right? Absolutely. And that's the same type of thing that we're able to do with with our home sale process and literally reverse engineer and micro target certain buyers and buyer groups for for each and every house, along with other strategies that we do. Uh, in regards to positioning it, um, how it comes onto the market. Um, there's so many certain variables that we're able to do, and when each of those add up, it's able to literally you know, make a difference of 5, 10, 15, up to 21% more right. um, in both speed and how much you're getting for that as well. Well, it makes a lot of sense when you put it that way. Uh, again, like I said, I'm kind of new at the whole real estate thing, so you have to put them in those kind of terms so that I can understand. I like that. All right, we are uh, in the middle here of the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show, along with Blake Sloan. If you've got any questions for Blake, again, please feel free to write these numbers down and use them. You can go ahead and call 808-SOLD, that's 808-SOLD, or go online to the website, blakesloanradio.com. That's Sloan spelled S-L-O-A-N, uh, blakesloanradio.com. And, of course, you can also email any questions you have to ask at blakesloanradio.com, blakesloanradio.com, the place to go. It's the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan on Hot Talk 99.5. Do you need to sell your home? Hello, it's Glenn Beck, and I know how frustrating it is. I mean, I just, I honestly, I sold my home a couple of weeks ago, and it took me a year and a half to do it. And I want to tell you about a realtor based in Myrtle Beach that I have personally met with. I'm talking about Blake Sloan of Sloan Realty Group, who has an immediate buyout program that allows you to sit down with him, determine a price, and a deadline and if blake doesn't sell it on time blake's gonna buy it for cash now this isn't smoke and mirrors blake owns a property management company and is always looking for great properties in myrtle beach to turn into rentals but more importantly month after month blake uses aggressive marketing to attract hundreds of buyers from all around the u.s that helps his home sell faster and for the most money Working with Blake puts you at no risk. If he doesn't live up to his end of the contract, he lets you tear it up so you can work with somebody else. Give Blake a call today at 808-SOLD. That's 808-SOLD or blakesguarantee.com. That's blakesguarantee.com. We're back with the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show, along with Blake Sloan on Hot Talk 99.5 WRNN. I'm your host, Dave Priest, along with Blake Sloan. 
And, um, you know, before we took a break, we were starting to talk about what's really going on as far as the real estate market is concerned. And I know that that's usually the first thing that everybody is interested in. So why don't you go ahead and tell us what's happening? Give us, give us a little bit of a market update. Absolutely. That's always the first question I get from anybody, friends, relatives. It uh, doesn't matter. But uh, so far, we're definitely seeing some improvement in our market here. Uh, for example, last quarter, single-family homes were up 14% over the same quarter last year. Um, and also, though, the only thing to remember that is median price has been down a little bit. Um, but the good thing, year-to-year -year sales so far um, are up 13% for single-family homes than they were uh, a year ago so far. So we've definitely seen some improvement. Um, we have seen the trend kind of go down in, in median price. Um, but there's been some fluctuation of you know distressed properties, bank-owned properties, um, things like that. But I would say the one thing to uh, – and they're expecting you know to continue to climb until the end of the fourth quarter. Mm -hmm. But the one thing to kind of watch out for first of uh, next year is going to be uh, this so-called shadow inventory. And what it is there's literally millions of homes that are either in default or you know troubled assets that banks have been kind of holding on to, and we've had a lot of insider information that said, hey, look, there was some pressure from the administration before to kind of hold off on those and obviously spread those out a little bit versus flooding the the marketplace with them. So uh, a lot of analysts have kind of got a concern saying, hey, look, there's a lot that's probably going to be dumping out uh, early 2013, but. Um, they're still expecting it not to make too big a difference. The numbers that uh, Wall Street Journal came out with uh, about a month ago said that you're going to see a, a huge climb for probably for the first half of next year right. and see it die down into third quarter. But uh, either way, the, the, the actual inventory, obviously supply and demand focus, but it's been so short everywhere. That's why a lot of other areas have seen you know significant gains, gains in pricing. But uh, we've stayed pretty steady here uh, through the past you know couple of years, but we've seen – uh, steady growth in regards to sales, and actually our, our sales numbers are pretty much right on track with what it was in 2004. So it's getting a little better there, um, but the one thing we're going to see early 2013 is going to be some shadow inventory mm -hmm. and also some increased inventory where everyone kind of tends to wait till the first of the year, um, and that's what we always tell everybody, hey, look, if right now if you're looking to get your house sold, um, I'll go ahead and get it on the market, even though there's holidays and stuff coming up. Right. Um, you can get a, a definite jump because – the, the demand's the same. There's much more supply with everybody throwing their house in the market first a year. You're definitely have a better chance of getting out there beforehand um, to be able to get you know more demand for that same exact house. Well, that makes sense. And it's all in those, those details. But either way, uh, we're definitely seeing some gains here. Uh, they're saying it's not going to be too bad in regards to the shadow inventory. Um, you know, it all depends on area, what market. A lot of those are Florida, you know, Nevada, things like that. So we should be okay. Uh, but we're definitely uh, studying it up a lot. So what else is happening? Uh, mortgages, I know a lot of people are wondering about that. Uh, what's the latest on the, the, the world in mortgages? Yeah, we're at unprecedented lows in regards to mortgage rates right now. I uh, just pulled them today from uh, one of our local lenders. 30-year uh, fixed rate, uh, you're at 3.375%. And that's just mind-blowing in regards to you know where these rates are right now. If you're looking at a 15-year fixed rate, uh, you're at 2.75%. And just looking at how those numbers break down, I mean, it's it's, it's huge – I feel like the difference between what a payment is for a hundred thousand dollar house at you know six percent uh, versus what it is you know when you're having something at three percent, and there's a lot more buying power that people have now, and that's why you've seen a lot of sales now. Um, for example, uh, about thirty one percent of the, all the homes sold in the U.S. are for first time home buyers, so people can now can buy for a lot less than they can rent for, and actually build equity, have ownership, and also have pride of ownership. And um, that's one big advantage we've seen. One thing that most people may or may not know about is uh, QE3. If you guys are familiar with that, um, basically it's the, the Federal Reserve announced they're going to buy $40 billion worth of uh, mortgage-backed securities every single month um, until they, they decide not to. So it's huge in regards to literally flooding the market with availability there, um, which has in turn kept rates so low. So it's a huge opportunity. Anybody that's renting, anybody that wants to buy, um, definitely now is the time. A lot of analysts are saying it's going to go up, obviously, early uh, of next year as well. So um, great, great opportunity for people looking to buy right now. And I know that you gave me some insider information that coming up at the end of the show, you've got some insider information as far as, uh, you know, how to uh, get some houses out there and, and get them quickly. Absolutely. There's tons and tons of, and as everybody knows, the deals are still selling fast. I mean, literally within hours. Um, we do all kinds of real estate. We're obviously one of the largest uh, foreclosure brokerages in the area as well. And um, we have a ton of homes actually going to be on the market. And what we have, something called the Unfair Advantage Program, and you can get access to those properties the very minute they hit the market. So before most realtors e even know about them, uh, you have access to that, pictures, information, the pricing, so you're able to beat other buyers to right. those houses. And we're going to show you exactly how to get that at the end of the show.
All right, you are listening to the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show along with Blake Sloan. If you've got any questions for Blake, of course, you can email at any time, ask at blakesloanradio.com, ask at blakesloanradio.com, or call him at 808-SOLD, that's 808-SOLD, and the website is blakesloanradio.com that you can go to. And I know, Blake, you've got a special guest in the studio with you. Yeah, we got uh, Randy Privet. He's actually uh, a member of our team here, literally uh, one of the top loss mitigators in the whole country. Um, he's a certified short sale expert and a certified distressed property expert. And uh, we definitely want to go over what he does, how it works, and he knows everything and anything about someone that may be facing uh, foreclosure, having trouble uh, with their mortgage. Um, but, yeah, Randy, welcome to the show. How you doing? Thank you. Um, and what we're going to do is kind of cover the basics because there's a lot of people that ask me the same type of question now. We're having trouble making our, our payment. Uh, you know, we're behind on payments. There's so many people that kind of wonder what to do. Um, we're going to cover exactly what their options are, what they can do. Um, there's also a new kind of arena that came out recently, uh, the st- uh, strategic defaults, what they call it, where let's say you have a house, you owe 500 on the house, you bought it at the very peak of the market, uh, the same house in, in the same neighborhood selling for 300 You know, there's a lot of people are just kind of walking away from that. So we're just going to talk about what's kind of going on and the different options they have. Um, but the whole kind of thing, do you want to kind of break down, Randy, uh, what kind of their options are, the, basically the four big basics? The four basic options that a homeowner has whenever they're looking at possibly going into default is they can either A, do a loan modification, or B, do a short sale, or C, a deed in lieu, and the absolute worst thing that can possibly happen to them is a foreclosure. And exactly with with that, and just so everyone knows, it all depends on your situation, Um, but the most important thing I would say uh, is to take action. We see a lot on the the foreclosure side where people just kind of really didn't do anything. They just kind of, you know stuck their head in the sand, so to speak, because obviously it's a it's an emotional thing to deal with and it's very tough, but I would suggest, hands down, no matter what your situation, reach out to an expert who, who knows about that situation and can truly guide you, um, and don't wait till it's too late to get that help. Um, but we also um, offer a free loan modification kit. Uh, it'll be right on the site for you guys. Uh, it's free, it's a community service, and it details exactly how uh, to, to do loan modification, which is an option for a lot of people. But Randy, I think you knew some numbers on uh, Th- those those failure rates a lot of times that it's hard to get those done. The reason that a lot of banks aren't willing to get offer loan modifications or do them is because of the re default rate, where people go in and the very few that possibly do get approved for them, eventually end up falling back behind within anywhere between six to eight months. So then the bank has got the property looking at possibly foreclosing on it again, and the modification never worked out, but. A lot of what I'm seeing is people try to apply for the modifications with the banks and jump through hoops and get them everything they're supposed to and either A, can't get them to call them back, can't get them to acknowledge where they are with it and string them along and string them along and then they come to them at the 11th month and say, we're sorry you didn't get approved for it. By the way, we're foreclosing in December. Sorry, you got to get out of your house. All your stuff will be on the street. And that doesn't happen, does it? No. (laughs) Obviously, you know, that's something that we see happens a lot. Uh, the other thing is we had talked about, too, the, they get this nice surprise in the mail a lot of times if they do a, a foreclosure uh, or deed in lieu. Yes, there's a lot of different programs out there available to homeowners um, that the banks offer them if they do short sell. Um, a lot of times um, the homeowner can sometimes get up to $30,000 at closing in a short sale situation for relocation assistance for down payment on a lease or for future p- plans, moving, et cetera, past the house once it short sells. And I'm glad you brought that up. We actually literally had a client, too, that he had a mortgage with, was it? It was with Chase. Chase, right? And he actually short sold his property. Uh, they obviously forgave that debt, and literally he got $30,000 at closing to, to do so, correct? Correct, and he didn't know anything about it. And when the bank sent me over the approval letter, I started reading it, and I couldn't read understand it, and I read it two or three times, and then when – I saw that they were going to offer him $30,000 at closing. I had to get a third set of eyes to come and look at it, our attorney. And they said, wow, he's going to get a check at closing for $30,000. And if he didn't do the short sale, that he was, they were going to foreclose on him. And he would have gotten hit with the re- uh, ramifications of the foreclosure. So now he's been able to help himself, save his credit, and also put some money in his pocket through going the short sale route opposed to just turning his back to it and allowing the property to foreclose. And one more thing, too, that we kind of run into a lot, people that go through the foreclosure, deed and lieu, uh, the IRS sends them a nice surprise at the end. Then usually um, they get a 1099. We've seen 
uh, for the difference there, but also obviously it's a big challenge to their credit. Um, there's some government stuff in place for the short sale uh, where they can get that, you know, for their primary residence when they do that. Um, there's some other options as well, right? Correct. There's a couple different options. Whenever you short sell the house um, or you foreclose or deed in lieu, you're going to have a nice 1099 come in January that you're going to have to file on your taxes for what you owe on the house versus what it sold. Well, the good part about it, there are options for that 1099 to address that so that you don't get stuck with a tax liability. But the good part about it, a short sale, is the homeowner actually working with the bank and having a say-so in the transaction and being able to agree or negotiate through stuff where a deed in lieu and a foreclosure is pretty much the bank telling you how it is, when it is, what it is, and they don't make options. You don't have choices. It's it's the golden rule. It's their gold. They're making the rules. So hands down, uh, short sale is the best option. We can probably do a whole show just on that, and we'll definitely do some in the future. But uh, the most important thing is to get with someone that knows what they're doing. And um, some horror stories we've run into uh, where we do both uh, the, the short sale, you know, pre-foreclosure side and also represent a lot of banks on the foreclosure side. And even this past week, uh, we had two homeowners that we got the, the bank gave us the listing. Uh, they had been foreclosed on. They didn't even know. They thought they were still doing a short sale. But their agent wasn't following up with the bank and, and making sure they're staying on top of it. It literally went to foreclosure. They had no idea. So once that happens, you can't go back. And that's something really important to, hey, look, how many short sales have you done? Uh, what's your success rate? What have you done in the past? And that's something really important to ask any agent uh, or anybody that you're getting advice from in that situation. And we actually checked recently, uh, roughly in our MLS locally, is about a 20 percent success rate mm-hmm. uh, with those. And um, here in our office, in our system that we've designed, uh, we have 90 plus percent success rate uh, with all those short sales. Tell you what we're going to do, but guys, we're going to take a quick little break right here in just a second, get you time to uh, have a sip of water because I know a lot of people have a lot of questions for you. If you do have a question, make sure and take down these uh, numbers, take down these addresses, call them, whether you uh, want some no-hassle home evaluation, if you want to know exactly what your home could sell for in today's market, as well as tips and tricks on what to do, here's where you go. You call 808-SOLD, 808-SOLD. You could also uh, email your questions to ask at blakesloanradio.com. Ask at blakesloanradio.com or just go to the website and check it out for yourself at blakesloanradio.com. That's blakesloanradio.com. You are listening to the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan on Hot Talk 99.5. Hey, Sean Hannity here. So what does it take to sell your home fast and for the most money in Myrtle Beach? Blake Sloan, Sloan Realty Group, has a system for attracting buyers that's so effective he can guarantee to sell your home at a price and deadline that you agree to or he'll have it bought with cash. Now, how can he do this? It's simple. Now, the average realtor in Myrtle Beach sells less than 10 homes a year and attracts a handful of buyers a month. Blake Sloan spends thousands of dollars and attracts hundreds of buyers every month, which creates demand for his homes and helps them sell within weeks, not months, and for top dollar. Now, you risk nothing since if at any point you're not happy, Blake Sloan, well, he lets you fire him and you pay nothing. Now, the phone call is easy. Not knowing your options or getting bad advice, well, that can cost a small fortune call blake sloan today at 808 sold that's 808 sold or get a free home evaluation at blakesguarantee.com that website again blakesguarantee.com You're listening to the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan on Hot Talk 99.5 WRNN. I'm your host, Dave Priest. And again, if you'd like to get in touch with Blake Sloan, 808-SOLD, or you can ask questions and just have the, get the answers emailed back to you, ask at blakesloanradio.com. Blake, um, you and Randy, you guys are really, really successful at getting the job done. How, how do you do it? I mean, what's your secret? Um, it's, it's actually a combination of a bunch of things. Uh, Randy's extremely good at what he does, but it has a lot to do with our, our business model too, where we actually have a setup where we have uh, obviously the real estate agent who helps on the real estate side. Uh, we also have loss mitigation with the loss mitigation company that, that we also have. Uh, but we also teamed up with a lawyer to help the, the homeowner through that process, uh, which also gives us more leverage with the banks when negotiating. Um, so we kind of have the whole thing all in one place for them that helps them. And uh, the great thing, there's not you know a lot of upfront uh, legal fees, anything like that at all, it's all basically, hey, look, we help get your home sold, um, and we actually have all this other stuff that you get with it, and that's why we're able to have uh, such a high success rate. But also, we have a full-time person that's dedicated to working on these files all the time. People get frustrated, you know, think, oh, the bank doesn't want to help, or short sale. 
uh, they don't realize that they're getting hundreds and thousands of, of submissions. And what it is is if it's not perfect, it's kind of getting thrown to the side. And uh, they're just literally understaffed for that. So all of our packages and stuff are perfect. And uh, Randy's been able to uh, fine-tune that, make sure they're able to, to get everything uh, so that we're able to get the front of the line there. We know and have relationships with a lot of these people because we've done deals with them previously. Um, we're also continually having uh, mastermind uh, groups and sessions uh, with other top agents and teams across the country, so we're adjusting. We literally reverse engineered what those uh, loss mitigators at the banks want, and we deliver that to them, exact packages, things like that. Um, and, and Randy obviously works it like crazy. Uh, funny story, one time he said, man, we got to go on some trips. It's like, why? And Randy's like, dude, I got girlfriends all over this country. Uh, he's on the phone working <laughs> them and uh, you know, calling them back and asking for their, their number, all kind of stuff. But what it is is he has a great personality with them, works with them, and is able to get that direct contact every time we were going back forward. Um, but any other things, that Randy, that you, you kind of do or know just – or want to share kind of the certain uh, success rates we have? Yeah, one of the biggest problems that I see and come across is some people decide to go with an agent that's not educated or haven't done enough short sales to know where the market is because the bank's guidelines and the rules and what they want, how they want it, when they want it change on a daily basis, and every bank's different. So if you're not doing enough to stay in contact with them and know how things are changing or where to put numbers or what they want to see, when they want to see it, how they want to see it, you can't be successful in doing it. You can't be a good brain surgeon if you work on three brains a year. Right. So <laughs> that's one of the biggest thing is is you got to be in the market. You got to be in the negotiation with them and know what's going on and what's changing because what's in place on Friday is more than likely not going to be there on Monday. And Randy literally is on three and four phones all the time. Uh, walk in your office, all you hear is hold music over and over <laughs> and over. Um, but it's it's something that most people they're juggling all these balls. It, you know what happens is the calling the banks hours and hours of time. Uh, is what the ball gets dropped. So uh, I guess we're, we're running out of yeah, time. Blake, with yeah, we've only got about a couple minutes left. I know there's some last minute things before our time runs out. You wanted to get get it on the air. Yeah, all these these properties. We literally uh, this past week have gotten uh, over 25 properties of new ones that are coming on the market um, that were from banks to the, the recent uh, foreclosure sale. And uh, we can get you a list of all those. Just visit our site. Um, go to blakesloanradio.com and you can sign up for that unfair advantage program. And uh, we'll get you priority access to all those listings the very minute they hit the market, and you're able to to be other buyers to those best deals. All right. I know that uh, you got some things already planned for next week, what we're going to be talking about. I know that uh, you've got, well, first of all, do we have time? We've only got about a minute left about talking about the unfair advantage program. Yep. We're going to cover that next week is okay. basically the entire buyer system. Uh, we can get you access to the absolute best deals. We also get you access to the best financing, uh, you know, most, uh, the best lenders, the lowest rates, and also help you through the entire transaction there. And we're also getting to that guaranteed sold system and show exactly how you can sell your house faster and for 21% more money. Absolutely. Well, if obviously, if you're in the market, if you're looking for a free, no-hassle home evaluation, find out exactly what your home could sell for in the market, as well as tips and tricks and all that stuff, he's the man to talk to. He's Blake Sloan. He's going to be here uh, every week. And if you need to get in touch with him, 808-SOLD, you can go and ask him a question on the email, ask at blakesloanradio.com, or just go to the website, blakesloanradio.com. Blake, 30 minutes went pretty fast. Absolutely enjoyed it, though. All right, Randy, thanks for joining us this morning, too. Thank you. All right. You have been listening to the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show with Blake Sloan. Again, those phone numbers and addresses, 808-SOLD. You can go to ask at blakesloanradio.com or just go to the website, blakesloanradio.com. It is the Expert Advantage Real Estate Show on Hot Talk 99.5 WRNN. You need to sell your home? Hello. It's Glenn Beck, and I know how frustrating it is. I mean, I just, I honestly, I sold my home a couple of weeks ago, and it took me a year and a half to do it. And I want to tell you about a realtor based in Myrtle Beach that I have personally met with. I'm talking about Blake Sloan of Sloan Realty Group, who has an immediate buyout program that allows you to sit down with him, determine a price and a deadline. And if Blake doesn't sell it on time, Blake's going to buy it for cash. Now, this isn't smoke and mirrors. Blake owns a property management company and is always looking for great properties in Myrtle Beach to turn into rentals. But more importantly, month after month, Blake uses aggressive marketing to attract hundreds of buyers from all around the U.S. that helps his home sell faster and for the most money. Working with Blake puts you at no risk. If he doesn't live up to his end of the contract, he lets you tear it up so you can work with somebody else. Give Blake a call today at 808-SOLD. That's 808-SOLD or blakesguarantee.com. That's blakesguarantee.com.